slow start, turnovers, execution. Um, it's important that we come out to a fast start, especially when they get the ball to start it at a second half and execute. We got to uh, make plays and keep the ball moving, keep the chains moving, be able to get out. Excuse me, get out of uh, backed up situations and move the ball down the field. What was it in their scheme that allowed you to have such a big night? We knew going into the game they were going to play a lot of man, so we knew we had matchups all across the board. It's just taking advantage of the matchups and finding open guys. Did you think 43 would be your matchup? No, we did not. Uh, we planned on Barron, uh, but we had a feeling he was going to be doubtful, then he ended up being doubtful. The interception in the end zone, just how did you read that ball coming in? Um, it was just a tough one. Uh, he just made a good play on it. I tried to do the best to get back to the ball and, and uh, break it up, but I just couldn't. What does it say about this team going the first half? You know, we're 145 yards and penalties and lead. Uh, man, just resilience. Uh, you got to be resilient. You got to be able to push through, snap and clear, go on to the next play. It's important at this level and it's important in this league that you be able to do that. And don't let one play define you. Uh, I feel like we left a lot of football out there in the field, and this team is much better than depicted in that second half. What was it like to watch Marshawn carry the whole team into the end zone in the first drive? It's exciting. Uh, it's been something we've been waiting to see ever since the end of last year. We know what he's capable of, and he's a huge piece to this uh, puzzle that we're putting together here. So uh, hopefully he just keeps doing it and keeps running through people's faces. John Green back. Here, his first game in a while with the Silver and Black. What did he say to this team in the locker tonight after the game? Um, we are a better football team than what was put out there on the field. And uh, this one game does not define us, and we got to make the corrections where we need to. Um, and just always push to get better, and never be satisfied, and just push to get better. Jared, obviously a very different offense. You guys are trying to learn on the fly here. Where are you guys in, in sort of that stage of mastering this group of offense? I don't think we're learning on the fly. We've had months to learn it. Uh, we know the offense. We know what's expected of us. It's just on us to go out and execute. No matter what the coach, call, the coaches call, no matter what the play they send in, we got, we still got to execute it the best of our ability. Uh, that's what our job is. So, and we just got to do a better job of doing that. What's the biggest difference in your mind between this football team now and at the end of last season? Um, y'all really don't know. It's a completely different team. It's a completely different team. I think it's a better team, but. It's a completely different team, so I really don't know. Is it a better team? Hmm? Is it a better team? I believe so. Well, Absolutely. The pieces that we got, the players that we got, the coaches that we got.